Here's how to recover deleted photos in Google Photos. Now, if you're in Google Photos and you accidentally deleted either an image or a video, I'm gonna show you your options to get it back. Now, of course, you can hop into Google Photos, the app here, and I'll walk you through some steps in here as well as on the website, photos.google.com. So say I tap and hold on one of these and then I hit delete. You can see it gives me the option here, allow Google Photos to delete this photo. And it says this photo will be deleted from your iCloud photos on all your devices. So if you hit this delete button here, then it will delete it from the Photos app on your iPhone as well. But keep in mind, you can always hit that library at the bottom, right? And then hit that trash right there and it'll take a bit of time for this to load. Sometimes this takes a bit of time, but you can see only deleted from Google Photos show here, they will be permanently deleted after 60 days. So if you hop out of here and you also just go to photos.google.com, I'm gonna show you some options in here. So say if I tap on a photo and hit the trash can icon again and move to trash. So I've deleted that and say I want to recover it. Again, I can tap on those three lines at the top left and I can go to trash. And you'll see that it will show any photos on here for 60 days and I can recover them just by tapping on it and then hitting that little trash can with a little X that will items and then hit delete here. So basically going through that process that will recover that specific photo. You can also tap the three lines at the top left and then tap archive because potentially you just put that photo in your archive and you didn't fully delete it. So going through all these steps, check your archive and trash folder to see if it is there. Another option is just go into the photos app on your iPhone itself or your Android and scroll through here to see if you see that specific photo or video on here because maybe you deleted it from your Google Photos, but it didn't physically delete from your iPhone or Android itself. Hope this helps. You have any questions on that? Leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.